uh, I don't want to draw you too much into the, the sort of the economic aspect of the debate, but, but looking around the world, when you look at other countries and how they've tried to balance out both managing the virus, but also trying to, in a sense, offer a protective basket to the economy, are you seeing any examples that, that you know, India could look at? Now we've got almost a year of the, you know, into the virus. Well, we have seen many countries offering uh, social safety nets and protection, including uh, salary protection or other forms of uh, income protection, mm. uh, so that uh, people could actually cope with the difficulties of the pandemic period. And even in terms of protecting the jobs, I think a fair amount has been done. Sure. Uh, but I would only like to make one point, uh, Srinivasan, that yes. even as the economy recovers, yes. The attention from health should not slip mm. because time and again we have seen that neglect of health yeah. chronically affects the economy, but public health emergencies are the banana peels on which the economy will keep slipping mm. if we continue to neglect the health system. Right. And in terms of employment, let me make a statement that health sector is going to be one of the biggest job creators in India and globally. Right. And therefore, that should also be seen as a potential fillip to the economy. Interesting. And creating a large number of jobs for young people. Okay. 